let's assemble an entire card drawer unit. These are the loaded options, and they are completely optional. You only receive these if you have purchased a loaded pledge level. Let's get these out of the way. Here's what we'll need. A drawer bundle. Scissors, wood glue, optional clamp, and five recommended strap clamps. Use scissors and cut off the strap keeping the bundle together. Here's what's in a bundle. For the drawer we have the front handle, two left pieces, two right pieces, the bottom, back panel, front backer, and front panel. These are all stacked together to make it easier on you. For the shelf we have the back panel, two side panels, and the two top and bottom panels. You can assemble these drawers in two ways, with the white side out or with the red side out. I'm choosing to have the white side out for this video. Ensure the side with no joints is facing you on all pieces. Arrange all pieces in their joints to make gluing easier. The white side is facing away from me to ensure that it is on the outside. Apply a small line of wood glue to each joint row. Take the furthest piece on the left and move it to the right side to line the unglued joints up. Apply a small line of wood glue to each joint row. Move the back panel between all unglued joints and apply a bead along each one. Now fold the back up with one of the sides, then continue to the next side. Finally, put the top shelf panel on. Now it's time for the strap clamps. Strap a clamp around the bottom, top, and then one across the middle. This will ensure the shelf unit is perfectly square. Let's set this aside and begin on the drawer unit. Again, we can assemble with the red or white side out. We want the white side out so we will place the red side up. Ensure you keep the left and right side pieces together. This will ensure you be able to have a uniform assembly. Place the pieces on the table with the thin tabs toward you. Make sure to keep the left and right pieces together. We need to glue the middle pieces in first. This is a crucial step.
Now apply a bead of glue along the unglued joints we align. Apply some glue to the sections shown. Grab the front panel and apply glue as shown. Slide the front panel over the middle two row pieces, then attach the right and left sides to the front panel. Grab the front backer and apply glue as shown. Glue here is optional. Wipe away any excess glue with a paper towel. Apply glue to the back panel on the opposite side of the color you want to be on the outside. Apply as shown. Slide the back panel onto all the pieces, wiggling them until they slide in nicely. Slide the handle into all four of the slots. Leave a little bit out to apply the glue to. Finally, after applying the glue, slide it in the last bit of the way. Wipe away any excess glue with a paper towel. It's strapping time again. Strap the bottom and the top with strap clamps. Be careful not to tighten the top strap too much. Now let's apply some felt. Peel back one inch of the adhesive cover and apply that portion to the drawer. Then, once it is applied, peel the rest and smooth it from that same end. Repeat for the remaining rows. Finally, the handle. Place one end in all the way, and pull the other end over the wood to snap it into place. Ensure it is all the way against the front panel to ensure the best fit. Squeeze both sides to ensure it is in the slot. Now you're done. Get to sorting those cards.